What's going on? Dynamic Smurf here, bringing you another gameplay of Aragami 2. This is a blind gameplay, as you know. I um, don't know nothing about the game. I'm just enjoying it as we play it. Last episode, I completed Mission 2 and Mission 3. Looks like, well, hopefully we can cram two missions in here. I don't know how Mission 4 is going to be, but can't wait to find out. Let's get into it. Aragami 2. Again, this is reminds me of Tenchi from the good old PlayStation One. Great control, same controls, I believe. Everything like that. It looks like they're probably more, a little bit more different things that they have in here, making more a little bit more of the fantasy side. If that's what it is. Tenchi was a more on the um, accurate side. You know, no super duper special techniques. This got more techniques, which I, I like that. Everyone likes that. You want to feel special when you're playing a hot game. A game like this, you want to feel special. And that's why I did two missions last uh, episode. I also wanted to buy this. I, I'm so used to X being action. All right, so now we have two points because I saved up one point. And I think I said I was going to go with... Well, see, now that I think about it again now, this stuns enemies close by. So, I mean, if we want to use this against the guys that's usually standing there or gets close to it. I wonder how big the radius is. Without us not knowing how big the radius is, we don't know how many or how close they have to be to it, I say. Like, for the people that are patrolling, if they patrol next to it, that would be one thing we'd want to know. But I do like this one. Just in case. And then, you know, what if I get hit? I don't want to get hit. I don't plan on getting hit. But what if? You know, you never know. And now, only question is, excuse me. Sorry if you heard that burp. But, um... Is this during, like, regular combat as well? I don't know. These are the questions that we need answered. And... Being that this is a blind playthrough, the only way we answer them is by just selecting them. So we're going to go with this one, because this is the one I said I was going to pick last episode. And we have it now. Now we can upgrade. Oh, so there's the upgrade for them as well. So you can attract only. You can attract only one target if you use the target lock. Oh, so if you use the target lock, then we can only... So, Whispering actually attracts more than one person if there's more than one person around. But if you want to, target lock by upgrading it. That's pretty good. So, yeah, okay. All right, let's go back. And, um... Looks like we gotta go up there. All right, double jump that jump. We'll do this. Double jump that jump. Hop on over everything. Look at this. Looks like leaders up here this time. What you got for me, leader? Cool. Cool. And if you don't know, since there's no voice talking, since, you know, some of a, we all talk at different paces, we all read at different paces. I want you to read it at your own speed, at your own time. You know, it's, it's your game too. I'm playing it, but you know, let you enjoy it the way you want to. Over here. Hi yo. Sakura. <laughs> Sakura.
the forge in the forge you will find support items equipment and essence units to craft all elements you will have to first find its blueprint during missions mission rewards often include blueprints but you will have to find others hidden in certain locations support items as well as abilities are your main aid to completing missions successfully unlike other objects these are consumed when you use them runes gain or grant bonus and debuffs you can assign a ruin to each piece of equipment head chest leg and sword well good to know well thanks looks like we got the ruins set up now we got shurikens i love shurikens they're my favorite Oh yeah, let's get all ten up in there. Get all five up in there. Why not? Oh no no, this is so you can only have four at a time. Oh shit, nope, nope. Tools to trade. Tool to trade and purchase. Oh just want all of them. Cold as steel. I like that. Steel match is so cool. Let's spend that money. Oh man, see, I don't know. That's too bulky. It's too bulky for me. It's too flashy for me. Yeah, you know? I'm a ninja. Yeah, you know? I like the mask. The mask cool because, you know, you don't ever see somebody wearing a metal mask. Now we have runes as well. Stealth and minus 10 to attack. Uh, so that's the one rune we have right now. And no rune. I like to be stealthy. So after also selecting it oh so you can only do one at a time i'm guessing that's what that is and i put it on the helmet that works for me that works for me all right well let's get into it So of course, get as much gold as we can. It looks like we can go accept the next mission, which is approaching the enemy. Yet, 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 yet. <laughs> Still not used to that yet, <laughs> but it's cool if you see you can charge up your middle slash. It's really cool. All right, so approaching the enemy, looks like we'll get 334 XP, 150 gold, and there are three collectibles to find. Looks like there's a blueprint as well, Amnesia Needle. I'm guessing that knocks them out, or they forget that you were there, or something like that. Well, we'll find out if we once we get that blueprint, we can learn that ability. Let's get to the portal and do our darn thing. Looks like we're going to eavesdrop into the conversation again, like Mission 2. Or Mission 1, I should say. Sorry. I'm getting my missions confused, you know? Just be out here being a ninja now. It's so confusing. Looks like we have a guard there. 
He does not patrol, he sits here. And we are in some grass. We have essence. We have a person right there. We get to that point. I don't know if you can see us from that point. But we're gonna take the risk. We cannot. Looks like there is tall grass here. This is different than the oh no, it's the same grass. We have us a mage here. No other person here. Just the mage. So let's get rid of that guy. And that's there's the conversation we need. We got the blood splatter. <laughs> no one is gonna think. Look, the guy patrolling. He's gonna see all that blood. And then do nothing. Like, come on, dude. You're not even doing your job. You're not even you're doing your job. Oh yeah, you got you've done, son. You done. You you done, son. As soon as you get over here, you know you're done, right? I'm gonna have to get rid of you. Why are you patrolling in this corner all by yourself? I'm sorry, dude. It had to happen. It just had to happen that way. It was just perfect. So, let's creep and see if we can get here. Oh, we can eavesdrop from up there. Is that what that was saying, I guess? Yeah, I want to aerial kill him. Which I kind of figured. So there's, there it is right there. This guy looks like he chills at the window, but he's a patrol. I think pretty sure he's a patroller. If he's not, then this is kind of easy for me. I can wait for him to start walking that way because it looks like this guy walks already this way from this point. And yeah, he's not a patroller. He actually just chills out the window. So I can, I can get in here and get these, this really quickly. As soon as this guy patrols that way, he turns around. I can come in at that same point when they both start to walk the opposite direction. Kill him. And do my thing. Let's try to get up from them. Yep, let's get up there. And there's gold. Actually, that wasn't gold. That's, in, that's actually something special. Let's actually go get that. He's coming back. And we can actually go just kill that guy to go kill that guy. <laughs> go get the gold from the other room. And that's what we're gonna do. Get this gold in this room. He's actually looking this way. Yeah. And so he's actually over here. Can you get him through the window? You can get him through the window. Oh, that is awesome. That is awesome. I think that's going to be the thumbnail. I think that's going to be the thumbnail right there. That was a beautiful grab through the window. With that being said, what's over here? Oh, so it's, is it them two again? Or are the two other people just chatting it up? And do I know where all the other boxes are, or do I have to let chat up? No, I'm pretty sure I know where all the other boxes are. He's going to turn back around. Just give us a chance to try to jump onto that. Hopefully we can jump onto that. I don't want to have to kill everybody. 
Which, you know what I'm saying? I don't have to kill everybody. There's gold. <laughs> Man, I'm about to go kill that guy. I want the gold. And maybe I don't have to kill him. Where'd that other guy go? He goes that way, so I don't have to actually kill anybody right here. I just jump down, get the gold, and get out. Shit, I just jump down, get the gold. It doesn't even matter. I think I'm gonna go this way. Get back to where I'm going. I don't think you can just jump up to this point. You can't jump up to that point. You'll we'll find out. You should walk a little bit more. Alright, so we made a mistake and, you know, did the attack. They fell off the get go. We died from the first death. Or we, our first death. Actual death, not dying by like falling off of something. Oh well, no. No, we learned our lesson. Don't be greedy. <laughs> Don't be greedy. We're not here for all that other stuff. We're here to kill. We're here to just, you know, do things. All right. So is he gonna ignore me now? Cause I'm gonna ignore that gold. fight you must die I want this gold I'm sorry I was greedy I know I just said don't be greedy but you know I failed the first time and I don't like failing at things yeah, I'm a big baby I know <laughs> game i think it's because we're being greedy for real we're trying to get as all the gold which i mean i get it i want s class oh my goodness they actually come up to places with you oh my god I did not expect that from this game. If one knows exactly where you are, he can find you like that. And so now he's gonna be lost a little bit. He's looking for me and now he's no longer looking for me. Which is great. Everybody's going back to their positions. It's even better, except for the guys are still looking for me. Woo! This is a way bigger map, too. I Way bigger map than I thought. So, there could be stuff anywhere. It 
the box could be anywhere, and I kind of thought they were close by. There's one. Which now they're all on high alert. Not good. Not good at all. But you know, it's a great addition. I'm glad I did, you know, get get seen so many times to see it, what it's like. And now I can see they jump up to buildings with you if they know where you are. Which is, is a great additive for Tenchi. Because they didn't have that in that. You can just jump on buildings and you can sit there for a long time and just, you're, you're safe. Now this, they actually hop around and stuff and look for you. Which is, makes it even better. Makes it harder for you. I like that. That's a way to amp up the difficulty. Because if you're a good stealth agent, it's easy for you. The fact that they can follow you is a great addition to this genre of game. But now we see there's only one person really looking for us still. It looks like that's the mage. This guy is shooting bombs at me and everything. Like, like who does that? <laughs> who does that? What kind of person are you? All right, let's, let's get drunk a little bit, you know? Let's get drunk a little bit. This guy does not want to stop worrying about me. He's about to get it. He's about to get it if he don't stop looking at me. Out of everybody, he was the only one that was still worried about me. Who saw me? Nobody saw me. They're just up. They're just an ant. They're just an ant all the time. Like, guys, gotta chill out, bros. Chill out. Chill out, bros. I got you. You gonna you gonna chill out here in a second? I'm gonna make you chill out. The rest of your life. <laughs> Dang, he went all the way down. That's even better for me. I can jump over and then land on this guy. Get that. I'm afraid to jump to that wall and not be able to grab it in time. You see, that's how you're supposed to get there. He's really looking for me everywhere else. I'm going to have to go this way because it seems a better route. Okay, I guess I didn't press that button. Oh, wow, you can't get in that window. That's what that is. They find a dead body so they get amped back up again. I'm pressing I'm pressing the wrong button. Alright, well, so that was a bust. Can't jump there from there. So maybe that's the exit, and it's just the background right here. Or maybe that's just something in... So the other one's got to be, like, somewhere over in that area. I just want to clean it up now, you know, got control of the map. 
and we're getting gold we're getting gold as well all right so back to me actually telling you what i'm gonna do instead of me thinking it in my head you know a little bit antsy there i died so i didn't want to mess it up so i want to get control of the map again all right so we have these three here some gold but i'm thinking the last one is probably like in, over here somewhere I'm thinking the last one's like over here somewhere. I'm gonna come over towards this area somewhere. Maybe it's in that building. The last, the last one's gonna be in that building. The furthest, the quote unquote furthest away from that section. Is that gold in too high places? We failed both missions. Goodness gracious. Oh, I get it. Oh, we done lost our first mission, guys. Mission four. Fail. That's what it is. So if you actually... Ah, uh, I see. If you get caught too many times, that also fails. If you fail both primaries, then you lose. But well, we're going to reset this mission and go through it. Now we got a little bit more on it. It's... <laughs> Why is it going backwards instead of feeling? That's so weird. Oh, now it's feeling. <laughs> Aw, we failed a mission finally. That's not good. It means this video might have to be split. Oh well. We got it this time. We know what to do. We have a better idea. So let's. Well, what <laughs> we'll handle it properly this time girl Long as I'm not creeping. Looks like if you're fast enough, you can still execute. Pressing the wrong button again. So remember, it's a left trigger, <laughs> or a right trigger. Loops right trigger. This one was a little bit actually more difficult. So you actually have to go slower here until you until you have it. Down pack of exactly what you have to do. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to this ledge here once he turns around and I'm gonna gank him. You don't see me, man. Like we'll walk back the other way. He's got good eyes. This is one of them that's got good eyes. Good eyes. And yay! All right, so once that guy walks that way, once this guy starts walking that way, I'm gonna gank this guy, grab it, and get back up here and go. All right, probably do it now. 
No. Now. Guessing it's gotta be in that last building room. Yeah. Did you get seen here? Is that what happened? We didn't get that gold last time, is that what happened? So as we stated, the, even though I did do the mission, you can come back and get the gold and stuff later on. So you know, you can do a all gold run, a one, a whole run where you do everything at once, or you can just do speed run and just not worry about the gold. So it just depends on what you want to play. How you want to play. Yep, that's, there's the last one. Figured that it would be over here in the back corner. Not really the back corner because uh, there's a portal, right? So, oh, but there's water. They got smart on this one. There's water, but you can go. Looks like once you get down here, hit here, go to there, go to there, go there, go there, and you'll be back where you want to be. This one is actually in the building, and this building is up against the water, but there is a. There's some steps here, which is great. Gives us good space. Try to use the camera as good as you, as well as you can, as you can see what I'm doing. Getting a good view of my surroundings. There's no one here. Box is on this side. He's patrolling to this point for a reason. There has to be something here. Yep, a door. Oh, that guy is watching? He's not watching. Gotta check, you know, gotta check. You make sure that they're good on their um, coding, you know. Gotta check. Yeah, so he's actually facing the other way. What are you doing on this computer over here? What are you doing on this computer? Wait. Wait, why can't you... T you can't kill him? Maybe they'll be like, dude, you don't know what you're talking about. There's no ninja. There was a ninja, man. There was a ninja. Hey, look. There was a ninja. He doesn't, he doesn't know what he's talking about. There's no ninja. You know, a snitch, man. Did you see that? He went to go snitch. I couldn't kill the snitch. I don't understand why. Ooh, there's a guy there now. I didn't see that guy. Maybe I was in a bad spot. Whatever, let's get out. You want to go tail, tattletale? No one likes a tattletale. Snipes! Everybody's like right here too. They're about to right here see me disappear.
There we go. I like that. That was a good move right there. That was a really good move to get out of there. That was a really good move to get out of there. That was a really good move to get out of there. That's the fastest route. That's the fastest route you want to take. You want to jump and uh, blast through. We got an S. I don't understand. We got an S. Dang. Didn't get our net neg never detected. But it's okay. More of a spirit. Not much of a ghost. We did get see a, seen a lot, but you know. We got an S rank. I don't understand how that's an S rank. Oh, we didn't really kill anybody. We just really got through fast and in a fast time. So uh, I guess less than 10 minutes. Um, so I guess this will be the end of this episode. Unfortunately, I failed the mission at the start. So it is a little bit longer episode. But um, we're going to do better on 5. I'm pretty sure we're going to do a lot better on 5. Um, but uh, you have a wonderful rest of your day. Because I know I will. Bye-bye.